Overcome with grief, the University of San Francisco learns of the death of one of its instructors. He was flying a plane with his family on board when that plane went down yesterday in Sonoma. ABC 7 News reporter Amy Hollyfield is on campus this morning in San Francisco. Amy? Hi, Reggie. A university spokesperson tells us those who knew Bill Goldman say he, they are just too distraught to talk right now. They did release a written statement calling him a generous and beloved teacher. Goldman was 38 years old. He was an assistant professor at USF. He comes from a very philanthropic family. He was, has served on the board of the Haas Foundation. He is the grandson of Richard and Rhoda Goldman, who were well known for supporting Jewish and environmental causes. The sheriff's office has now released the name of the woman who was hurt in the crash. She was on board. It was the family's nanny, 24-year-old Valeria Anselmi. Goldman's young son and daughter, George and Marie, were also pulled from the wreckage south of Sonoma. Noma. They survived, but officials say their injuries were, are severe to critical. A witness rushed to the scene yesterday afternoon after watching the plane fall to the ground and helped the little boy. We just helped him out a little bit, but he, he popped out. He was, George is his name, you know? What's your name, buddy? My name's George. Can you get me out? Yeah, hang on. I'm going to cut the seatbelt. Okay, stay away from this. Cut the seatbelt, got him out, and he was able to pop out. The Cirrus SR-22 plane had a high-tech parachute, and Sky 7 was over the crash where you could see the orange and white parachute that had been deployed. Witnesses say it looked like, though, the plane didn't have enough altitude for that parachute to help. The FAA and the NTSB are on the scene investigating what happened and why this plane crashed. Live in San Francisco, Amy Hollyfield, ABC 7 News. A plane carrying a San Francisco family crashes in the wine country. Children pulled from the wreckage, and tonight we've learned one of the parents did not make it out alive. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. Larry Beal in for Dan Ashley. And I'm Ama Dates. Late today, the Sonoma County Sheriff's Office identified the father killed in the plane crash. He was 38-year-old William S. Goldman of San Francisco, commonly known as Bill. The crash happened just outside the Sonoma Sky Park. ABC 7 News reporter Cornell Bernard live in Sonoma County tonight with this developing story. Cornell. Larry, I'm the wreckage of the plane still in this field behind me, about a thousand feet from the runway where it took off this afternoon. Now, FAA investigators will be back here tomorrow to find out what caused this high tech aircraft to crash. We heard a plane taking off uh, and sputter. Didn't sound right. Robert Castillo was having lunch at a friend's house when he witnessed the terrible crash. A single engine plane plummeting to the ground just seconds after taking off from the Sonoma Sky Park Airport. Really uh, heavy um, fuel smell. So what, what I was concerned with is that there was a spark that would go up. Worried the plane would explode, Castillo and friends rushed to help until first responders arrived. They pulled a mother and two young children from the wreckage, a girl who was unconscious and a boy. What's your name, buddy? My name's George. Can you get me out? Yeah, hang on. I'm going to cut the seatbelt. But their father, who was piloting the plane, did not survive. 38-year-old Bill Goldman from San Francisco was an assistant professor at USF. 
He was flying a Cirrus SR-22, a high-tech aircraft with an emergency parachute. Sky 7 was over the crash where the orange and white chute was visible. What did you hear, first of all? A big bang. Scott Peterson works near the airport. He says the plane didn't have enough altitude for the parachute to help. One of our guys said that the when the parachute came down, it, it just pointed the nose straight down. Three family members are in the hospital. An airport manager says Goldman told him the family was flying to San Jose, but kept their plane in San Carlos. The NTSB will join the FAA in its investigation of the crash. In Sonoma County, Cornell Bernard, ABC 7 News. And we have more details tonight on Bill Goldman. He was the grandson of Richard Goldman, the prominent San Francisco philanthropist who founded the Goldman Environmental Prize. William Goldman was also an assistant professor of international studies at the University of San Francisco. And he flew missions for Angel Flight West, a charity that provides transportation to sick patients and their families. Goldman was married to Sarah Falk Goldman, an attorney. As we mentioned, she was on board the plane. She survived. And stay up to date with the latest on this story with the ABC 7 News app. Download the app for free and enable push alerts to get breaking news updates as they happen.